Then we add sugar to our meat to give it the signature flavor you've come to love. Side effects may include constipation, fatigue, obesity, and diabetes. Put the delicious muck into casing. You can fry up any of our meat products with your family every night. All you have to do is take one pill every day for the rest of your life. Hi, welcome to our show. My name is Kai Begay. I'm Kendra. Sick and tired of feeling sick and tired of our modern cuisine? So are we. Today we're focusing on food that you need to survive and fly for. Food that nourishes and heals you and, most of all, puts your family first. We're fighting diabetes with native plant-based food. Without breaking the bank. Today's challenge is we're going to be making a delicious meal under $10 using the native power plate. Question. What is the native power plate? We're glad you asked, Judge number three. The native power plate is the pattern of eating unlimited foods of four food groups. Whole grains, vegetables, beans, and fruits. Scientific studies have shown that eating these four food groups can turn around A1C levels and reverse diabetes. Returning to ancestral plant-based food is how we can reclaim our health. Our competitors, competitor number one. My name's Rochelle, and as a chef, I like to personally cook with corn because one, it's one of my favorite native foods out there, and because it's also very healthy. Contestant two. Hi, my name is Janica, and as a chef, I specialize in making food with beans. The beans are high in protein and fiber. They can help prevent diabetes by stabilizing blood glucose. And last and finally, contestant number three! My name is Ajani, and as a chef, I like to work with all sorts of colors, like just like a rainbow. For me, working with colors is the best thing. And having more colors, is like, it's like being fun. It brings out my inner child. <laughs> the health aspect of using more of a variety of colors, it's like the more colors, the more minerals you get or more vitamins you get. These are all natural colors. Like they're not dyed into what they're supposed to be. It's just all natural and they're really good for you. Being colorful is what I live for. Now it's time to be our judges! I'm a mom with a big family. I need to feed a lot of hungry people on a budget. I'm a busy person. I work all day. I don't have time to cook all night, so I need to whip something up fast. I'm hungry. Okay. I'm really hungry. Whatever they make better be filling. Like I always say, where's the meat? Today's challenge is about plant-based foods. So that means plant and meat? No, just, just, just plants. So plant and then meat? No, plants from start to finish. As it turns out, you can get everything you need just from plants. secret recipe on how I cook so healthy on a tight budget. Beans, cashews, walnuts, almonds, quinoa, raisins, oatmeal. Simple, healthy, and cheap. It might take longer to cook my dry beans, but I am getting so much bang for my buck. Contestant number three is in the fresh produce aisle. Look at all the colors.
Testing number three is shopping in the frozen food section. In the refrigerator aisle is where I substitute a lot of things for meat and dairy. See like non-dairy milk, non-dairy butter. Same great taste, but without all the cholesterol and fat. Sometimes I'll even use the alternative meat, but to be honest, they're a bit pricey and not as healthy as I like them to be. But I usually go for one main thing, which is really good, which is tofu. What is tofu anyway? You don't know what tofu is? Oh, it's just beans. Soybeans. And contestant number one is stopping at the Ken Good Isles. I love fresh fruits and vegetables, but I don't have the time to be chopping and peeling and cutting it. And I hate it most of all is when it goes bad and it's not fresh anymore. So I just, I, sometimes I get canned food or frozen food. But even so, I have to be careful because I don't want mixed weird junk in it and that will not make the food go good and not as healthy as I want it to be. Now contestant number one is going to the frozen food section. Ooh, cold. Frozen spinach, frozen green beans, and frozen fruit. It's nature's candy. I love it fresh, but I'm on a budget and it's a lot cheaper frozen. Contestant number two is checking out. 750! How about that? And here's contestant number three. She's weighing around, wow, $5.25. I don't believe it. Contestant number one is ringing out at Wheat flour, sea, sea salt, vegetable powders, onion, garlic. These noodles are low fat. They're made without egg and oil. Any type of rice noodle or healthy noodles are okay. This is vegetable broth. This is what I'll use if the seasoning packet is not healthy because it has like a lot of salt and other stuff. I'm gonna just let that heat up. Chilies have five times more vitamin C than one orange. So you can eat five oranges compared to just eating one milk. Today, I'm using black beans, which are in this measuring cup, as you see. What I have in my hand is a quinoa plant. It is high in protein and also has nine amino acids. It's done. So these are cashews that I have soaked overnight and you can do it for two, for two hours if you are in a hurry, but soaking them overnight is way better. I like to cook with blue corn because blue corn has 20% more protein than white corn. The reason why I cook with juniper ash, a gram of ash is actually has more calcium than a glass of milk. The ash also helps release more nutrients from the blue corn and helps it contain its blue color.
Yeah. Chef, what do you have for us today? I made um, green chili rainyarks, a side of salad, and blue corn mush with blueberries. This takes less than four dollars to make. I'm in. Chef, what are you serving? I made a quick vegetable ramen with low-fat noodles, tofu, and fresh vegetables. Enjoy! <laughs> You're telling me this only took five minutes to make? I'm in. Chef, what did you cook for us today? Today I made a Mother Earth bowl, which is powered by my favorite ingredient, beans. Judges? Sorry, I like to take good naps after a good meal because it was like really good. Now maybe I should ask, where's the beans? Judges, do you have a verdict? And the results are in. It's a three-way tie. Everybody wins with these healthy plant-based meals. Are, are you, you ready, ready to, to try? try?